Do you do you have an example of one thing? Uh, the, the actual the, in uh, where the blues comes from, um, some of the melodies in there are some of the melodies of the traditional griots, and you notice you'd have to you'd have to be a musician to know you know that you play them faster and suddenly it's a blues song okay. and it's something that was in all these people in Africa and it came out as what we now call the blues because of the slavery and maybe yeah what fascinated me really though is that I believe that uh, the American blues is the, the most famous especially because it, it, it began rock and roll but it's not the only one you know uh, flamenco music especially when you know the, the lyrics is is very blue you know it's very deep and and they also do it for the same reason uh, they sing it to feel better so they sing about their problems emotionally and afterwards they feel better you know and this is where gospel music came from you go in a church and you go through your bad emotions and at the end of the, the the time in church it's gone very fast and it's very happy and I saw this happen in, in the Caribbean in a very very old small church where they'd, they'd never even had a white person in there and I was fascinated. I was fascinated that the uh, I struggle for the, the word. I was fascinated at the way the music gave a signal of the emotion. Uh, and I became very, very in, into it, you know. And I didn't want to do anything else. And after what had happened to me, and because I was now, you know, God wasn't good to me medically, but uh, we did very well financially. Yeah. We sold 22 million records. And it just seemed such a waste of life just to make another CD. I didn't want, I said, oh, I don't want to make another CD ever again. I want to do a musical project because I've done 18 CDs and I agree who needs another Chris Reed CD you know so I said okay every time Chris Reed does something now it's going to be something interesting and different not just the same as the other 18 CDs but when did you I've got to say I've got to say that I'm not a saint <laughs> if, if I hadn't been ill I, I probably would have still been playing the game, you know. 